Hey guys, thanks for downloading the Creative Color Grading Packs. I'm going to walk you through how to install these with Adobe Lightroom Classic CC. Now this will work with version 7.5 or newer. Um, so if you need to check what version you're operating with, um, go just go to your help menu at the top, down to about, and then right here it'll show you which version you have. And again, this will work with 7.5 or newer, and this is the easiest way to do it. If you have an older version of Lightroom, you can either update by going to that same help menu, and then down to updates, and that'll walk you through it. Otherwise, we will show you in another video how to install these, but this is the easiest way if you're with 7.5 or newer. If you look over here on my desktop, I have the master collection of the 3D LUT profiles. This is one folder with every XMP in it. Um, there's a lot here. There's actually 100 XMP files, but we've designed these in a way that once you install them, it'll actually break them down into their individual packs and folders. Uh, it looks really nice in the profile browser. So um, I'm just going to leave that on my desktop for now. Make sure once you have that downloaded and unzipped that you back it up somewhere in case you need to ever update computers or anything like that. Um, always back up your stuff. Okay, now in Lightroom, you want to go to your develop module. So go to develop. I have a raw file open here. Make sure you have a raw file open and this is just be easier and it'll look the same as what I'm doing. Once you're in develop, you want to go to basic and drop that down. And then right here, you'll see it say profile. You want to drop that menu down and then click browse. Now, once you're here, you'll see a little plus sign right here. And that's what you want to click. And that will drop down. And then you want to go to import profiles. Now, once you do that, um, this file explorer will pop up in Windows. And then really all you need to do is locate your download folder. Uh, mine's on my desktop right here, master collection. So open that up and then you'll see those XMP files again. And what you need to do is highlight all of those. So what I'm going to do is click one of them and then hold control A and that highlights all of them and then just click import. Perfect. And then I'm going to go back out. So this makes more sense. So in develop now, when we go to profile and that drop down menu, you still go to browse. And then if you see right here, each of the 10 packs is broken down into folders, and each folder has 10 3D LUT profiles within them. So here's candy cigarettes, daily bread, and so on. So I'm going to open up Cocaine Roller Derby for our picture of Seth here. Um, if you just hover over each profile, you'll see an instant preview. And then once you see something you like, just click it, and that will apply it. And then right up here, you'll see an intensity slider. So you can actually adjust the intensity of that profile. So that's really it. You just install them um, going through, again, I'll walk you through develop and then go down to basic and then profile, browse. And then from here, you want to click that plus sign, import profiles, locate the files, select all and then import. Now I'm not going to do it again because I already have them, but I wanted to show you guys that again. Um, and then once those are installed in Lightroom, they will also work in camera raw. So if I open up Photoshop, you'll see that it will work with both programs. So I'm going to open a file. We'll do Seth's raw image again. And that opened up Camera Raw here. Now in Camera Raw, same thing. If we go to Profile right here, drop down, Browse, you'll see all the profiles are right in here in their individual pack folders. So Cocaine Roller Derby, drop down, hover over, click on one, and you can adjust the intensity. And then you can also go and make all these adjustments. If you notice, all the sliders are still at zero. So we can make adjustments on top of the pack. So that's how to install those with Lightroom Classic CC. Um, thanks for downloading.